Hi guys, I'm Glenn, I'm new to Tarot, and I have a beef with Tarot. I am new, and I'm tempted to wait until I've learned a bit more, but it's bugging me now, so I thought I'd just throw it out there now and, and see if you all have thoughts about this. Um, I'm sure you've heard plenty already about the uh, uh, hashtag Taroso White, and uh, you know that doesn't apply to all decks, but boy, it applies to most of the ones I've seen. Um, I got no beef with Pamela Coleman Smith. She did beautiful work 107 years ago, but when I pick up a 2017 deck and every single person in that deck is white, what are we doing? I mean, it's just, it's, it's, it's definitely this sort of Eurocentric, patriarchal, heteronormative, lots been said about that already. Um, but my additional concern like all of that, it's part of this, I, this umbrella of Tarot being a tool of conformity, which sounds like a bizarre thing to say because I feel like Tarot is so much about finding your own path, your unique vision, your place in this world. How can that be about conformity? And yet it is reinforcing you know, racial stereotypes, gender stereotypes, all of these things. And I'm concerned that Tarot is privileging the suit of cups and marginalizing the suit of swords. So privileging cups, you know, emotion, love, your heart's true mission in this world, how can that not be a wonderful thing? Well, it is a wonderful thing, uh, unless it's used to reinforce, again, these kind of, you know, traditional family values uh, at the expense of intellect and the mind. So here's, here's, here's a couple for you. Um, look at that. Two of Cups, connection, relationship, sharing, beauty, joy, wonderful. Two of Swords, Ugh. too much thinking, conflict, crisis, problem. Three of Cups, let's party. Three of Swords, slice your heart to bits. Nine of Cups, you've made it. You've got it all. Yay, total material success, pleasure, it's yours. Nine of Swords, ooh, you thought too much. Nightmares, terrors, close that crazy mind of yours down. And of course, Ten of Cups, the ultimate patriarchal, heteronormative success story. Get married, make babies, live happily ever after, or think too much. We know what that spells, death and disaster. So, I don't know, what are you doing, Taro? Why so many happy cups cards? Why so many terrible sword cards? Why? And so for anyone listening, I mean, please leave a comment below, make a video reply. I would like to know, is this not the shut up, don't think too much, make babies and be happy card? Is this not the after the revolution, the first thing we do is kill all the intellectuals card? Is this not the Vladimir Putin throws pussy riot in prison card? Is this not the Donald Trump crushes gold star Muslims, bad hombres, and nasty women card? Is this not the under the Obama administration's watch, Aaron Swartz dead, Chelsea Manning in prison forever, Edward Snowden in exile in, of all places, Vladimir Putin's Moscow card? Is this not the anti-intellectual, don't think too much, just be happy card? I don't know. I'm concerned, Taro. What's your beef with swords? What's your beef with communication, intellect, mind? I think it's a good thing.